creed in the Marines, leave no man behind. That's right, new at 6. 10 News anchor Kimberly Hunt went to the Vista Jail to surprise a local Marine who lives by that oath long after leaving the battlefield. My crew and I arrive at the Vista Jail and get the plan. We're going to burst into the morning meeting with Glendon Morales in a room full of deputies and scream surprise. I'm all in at first. Sergeant, you have your vest on? No. Okay. Yes, I do. <laughs> I'm the only one without a vest. <laughs> People in there are armed. Or have we thought this through? Partially. <laughs> right. We're going in. Surprise! Oh, Channel 10 is giving you a 10 News Leadership Award for oh, all of your oh, great yes. work. Right. <laughs> Yay, we're in. No shots fired. And Morales is smiling. On behalf of 10 News, Lead San Diego, and Media for Women, we want to present you with the 10 News Leadership Award. Thank you. Thank you. For the last two years, Morales has been leading the Veterans Moving Forward program at the Vista County Jail. Somewhere in long line, they got lost. Veterans who serve their country and then can't find their way back into jobs and relationships, but instead fall into crime. In the beginning, most of them, no hope. But as they stay in the vet mire and we talking and working and going to group, you see hope. You see the change in them start. I can't make it. And almost all of them do make it back. Only 6% of the vets who get the counseling and services provided by Morales ever end up back in jail. He reminds them who they are. And let them remember the good things that they have done in their life and that they could do it again. All right, Morales and veterans moving forward work with help from the community and local churches. They need resources like treatment centers and transitional housing. If you know of these services in the North County, you can email Glendon Morales. His email address is on 10news.com under the red TV button.